All right, guys, so <clears throat> let's see you wrecked your Forester. This is a 2015, similar to that big vehicle over there. It's just white. Let's say you wrecked your Forester, you bought a new hood, you painted it, and you wanted to transfer stuff over. I'm sure you guys had to remove this cloth. The, the hood's damaged, the car's already paint. So I'm sure you guys had to remove the cloth out of here without damaging it. I um, need one of these like clip removers. Both. This is a longer handle, easier to get to. They yeah, get underneath the. Uh, Underneath these guys, see how this is like this? And just... It just got little fuzzies. I stick this underneath here and just push up, push down and then push up. But pull your hand on it because it'll just pop out of the way. So let's do it again. You, if, if, if you're not too careful, you can poke this. So just try to easily just get underneath it. And and pull it out. Yeah, you're gonna put a little bit of pressure on the cloth, but it's it's not. It'll, it'll come back to shape. See this guy right here. And if you're not careful, what will happen is you'll take this and you'll go right right underneath this cloth and destroy it. Um, so this one's a little hard to get to because they're. So what I've done is I'll, I'll put this guy right here. It uses leverage. So I don't really, see I don't want to damage this surround. So I put, use my tool as leverage. There it goes. This crease, it'll all come back out once it's going to the engine bay, it heats up. This one just, Boom. The middle one's gonna be the hardest one. Uh, let's see. That one came out easy. This one's pretty easy to the edge. So this one. Oh, there's one more right here. Boom. Save all the clips. Now that one, I'll try to sneak underneath it, but it ain't gonna work. We got one more here, so. As you can see how much pressure the hood's got on everything. We got one more here, but this one's the tricky one. You gotta get underneath it. Let me see, maybe a shorter one. Just trying to pull up without destroying the liner. Aha! My finger put right here, but. Uh, oh, we got one more. What's a flat spot though? It's okay. Right here. Once you remove it, see how it, it went back in shape. When it's underneath the hood and it heats up, this will form itself back into shape. It's still reusable. If you're nitpicky, spend, you know, I don't know, maybe $100 and get a new one. Um, I'm going to put this right here because we don't have the car back from paint till Monday. And then um, I'll go ahead and put that on then. Save all the clips. Maybe put it in the bag or something. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put them in our trays over here. This is basically our Forester tray. We use everything for Subaru, so it's all the hood clips going here. And when I get back to putting the car back together, we'll dive back in there.